The wavy ellipse in gray denotes the resection area. The superior margin is marked along natural contours. Desired dental show helps guide inferior margin placement and hence resection height, which ranges between 4 and 12 millimeters. The ends taper into the alar creases to prevent tissue bunching. The flaps are 4 to 8 millimeters tall and 2 to 3 millimeters wide. Starting with long flaps is preferable as they can be trimmed later. Approximately 5 cc's of buffered lidocaine with epinephrine is infiltrated uniformly into the resection area. Resection is performed in the subcutaneous plane. However, a thinner resection at the sills preserves their integrity. The flaps are undermined and advanced into the nose to gauge dental show restoration. Resection of the tips allows the flaps to bear the full tension. Key sutures are placed with 4O chromic, mindful of incorporating the tough superperiosteal tissue of the vestibular floor, roughly 5 to 9 millimeters above the sill. A caudal sub resection enables lateral lifting. The skin is sutured with 6O proline. The remaining closure is performed using 5O chromic in a simple interrupted technique. <laughs>